Commandment 18 comes from the 17th chapter of Genesis, and it is oftentimes a very controversial command. There are people who don't believe this should be done. They say it's mutilation, or they say a lot of other stuff about it. I don't have an opinion on uh, anything outside of the commandment. So, let's read the commandment. Genesis 17, 9. And Elohim said unto El Abraham, You shall guard my covenant, therefore you, and your seed after you in their generations. So that would definitely be us, right? We are from the Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob generations, and the seed, we are that seed. This is my covenant, which ye shall guard. Between me and you and your seed after you, every male child, here's the commandment, among you shall be circumcised. And ye shall circumcise the flesh of your foreskin, and it shall be a sign of your covenant betwixt me and you. And he that is eight days old shall be circumcised among you, every male child in your generations. He that is born in the house or brought with money of any stranger, which is not of your seed. He that is born in your house and he that is bought with your money must need to be circumcised. And my covenant shall be in your flesh for an everlasting covenant. And the uncircumcised male child whose flesh of his foreskin is not circumcised, that shoal shall be cut off from his people. He has broken my covenant. So it is very clear that if you are not circumcised, there is a lot of difference. And there's a tremendous amount of difference between, I guess, what they would call a back-in-the-day circumcision. Because I believe the circumcision happens very quickly in the hospital. I don't know when exactly. But this is a commandment of eight days, right? So you are, once your, your child is eight days old, you're supposed to have them circumcised. So in that command, you will want to have your child circumcised. So if you are having kids now or you're right there and you are just hearing this right now, give it eight days after he is born and as a commandment of our creator, have him circumcised. If it's before that or after that, you, I would definitely, you know, do it. If it's afterward, definitely do it. But if it's before, don't let them circumcise your child until after day eight, because that is a commandment. And you will be blessed by this. And people are like, wow, this is really, really weird. What, why, why would you do this kind of stuff? And it's essentially a sign. I mean, it's a covenant, right? You're marked. You're a marked in a certain way that our creator has said to do this. Why? I don't know. You'd probably have to be a doctor or somebody else to have figured this out. Um, what is the difference between circumcised and uncircumcised? Um, all I know is that it is a commandment, and this is commandment number 18. Much love. I'm out.